the storage from Hitech Legion. Obviously, when you're going to be looking at storage these days, you're going to be looking at an SSD. And right now, the SSD market is the best it's ever been. Prices are coming down, obviously, and the size of the drives is going up along with it, making it a much more viable solution for most people. Now, the uh, market itself, though, also might be the most confusing it's been in a while. While you've got the enthusiast class SSDs, which run uh, pretty much the same price point and offer similar performance, the mainstream segment has actually gotten uh, more than a little convoluted recently. What we're seeing is a lot of mainstream drives with a lot of different controllers and a very, very big difference in performance among them. Today we're going to take a look at OCZ's mainstream offering, the Vertex 460 240 gigabyte. On the outside, the Vertex 460 shares a lot in common with the uh, Enthusiast Class Vector 150. Now, first, quick look at the box, obviously. Vertex 460, 240 gigabyte. Got a nice little picture of the drive itself on the box. Around the back, really not a whole lot of information. Uh, SATA 3, MLC flash mod, uh, memory. They actually do use uh, 19 nanometer Toshiba uh, MLC NAND flash in this drive. Trim support, also idle time garbage collection. Three and a half inch SSD adapter included. Acronis uh, Truant Image HD software included, and three-year warranty on the drive. Now, taking a look at the drive on the outside, very, very nice looking drive, as you see. Um, one of the things uh, OCC does is uses a very, very solid outer shell, all metal, uh, on all their drives, uh, and the Vertex 460 is no exception. So you've got a really, really solid piece of equipment right here with the Vertex 460 going around the back. You've got your four mounting holes and of course, seven millimeters thick. So it is gonna go into Ultrabooks uh, or anywhere a seven millimeter or a larger drive would go as well, of course, with an adapter and your SATA connectors on the drive. So really good looking drive. Now, of course, the fun part of the SSD isn't on the outside of the drive, it's on the inside of the drive. So let's dive right in. Now, first off, OCZ is using the Indolinks Barefoot 3 M10 controller on this drive, same as they're using on their Vector 150, along with the 19 nanometer Toshiba MLC NAND, also present on their Vector 150. So you're getting the same enthusiast class components that you're seeing on the top line drives. Uh, there is a little bit difference of endurance. Now, the um, Ve uh, Vertex 460 is rated for 20 gigabytes of writes per day for three years and comes with a full three year warranty. Obviously, Quite a bit of warranty there, quite a bit of endurance as you're seeing. Now taking a look at it physically, what you see here is right here, the Barefoot 3 controller actually has a thermal pad on it. It uses the casing of the drive itself to dissipate some heat off of the controller. Micron DDR3 controller right here and your MLC NAND flash. Now you do have quite a bit of uh, over provisioning. You've got the flash around the back as well. Very well put together uh, circuit board also, I might add. Um, you've got See, um, quite a bit more over-provisioning here than you did in the Vertex 450 or in most drives in general. The over-provisioning is going to allow for better wear leveling, better use of trim, better use of idle time garbage collection. So you're going to get a bit more endurance out of the drive as a result and sustained performance is going to be a bit better. So OCZ has done very, very well there. Now also talking about performance, OCZ has rated this combination for 95,000 IOPS on the read side, 90,000 on the right side, and sustained read speeds of 540, uh, 545 megabytes per second, sustained rate of 525. So you've got some serious performance here, especially in a mainstream drive. So you've got a very nicely put together drive. You've got top quality enthusiast class components throughout. You've got great shock absorption uh, through that metal casing, as well as the solid construction. So what you're gonna get is a really well put together drive that's gonna be up for being in a laptop, up for being in a desktop, up for being in absolutely any environment, and it's gonna be able to withstand some punishment, give you enthusiast type performance at a mainstream type price. Included with the Vertex 460 is a three and a half inch adapter and OCZ, I love my SSD sticker. Simple quick start guide, warranty information, and most importantly, a key for a Cronus 2013 HD True Image. A great um, piece of software used for updating and backing up. Uh, so if you are coming over from another drive, it's gonna make the installation of your Vertex 460 very, very simple and act as a very powerful backup for you in the future. 
The Isuzu Vertex 460 was incredibly impressive in all our benchmarks, offering enthusiast-type performance at a mainstream-type price. Uh, to get a look at the test setup and all those benchmarks, and to find out why the OCZ Vertex 460 took home a High Tech Legion Gold Award, just click on the link below and head over to the full review.